uh, hi guys, um, another Diablo 4 video. Let's get it.
okay so um, as you saw from the footage or you probably guessed this is this video is, is going to be about leveling from one uh, to 100 and the quickest way that I do it um, I can do it in around uh, five and a half um, six hours something like that five hours um, and it's really really easy so my previous video that I did on Diablo 4 was about um, the best way to guarantee uber unique um, items and that was all to do with the hell tide and, and, and the wolf season event um, this time it's going to be all about um, leveling as quick as you, quickly as you can but it's going to be in the nightmare dungeons okay so as always i always start from the beginning i try and keep it short and sweet but i try and give as much information as i can um so it's it's just so easy to do i don't like these long drawn out videos so i, I don't do them it's as simple as that okay so if you're running um the sorcerer or the necromancer you can start world tier two if you want in my opinion that this is just my opinion um so but if you're running druid or barbarian i start at world tier one until i get to level 20 and then i move up to world tier two rogue i haven't even tried this season i'm just not feeling it so i don't know about that one that's, that's going to be what you guys already know about that um this doesn't work on your first character a couple of other tips it only works on our alternative character and the reason for this two reasons for that and that's because you want your aspects to be as high level as, as possible and you also need the materials because you, you're going to be re-rolling um, items an awful lot especially early game from like level one to level was level 20 sorry from level 20 to level 50 you'll be re-rolling a heck of a lot and then you can start to slow down the higher up um, the levels you get okay so what you do is you start the game well to your level one you go into the hell tide um, until you get to level 20 um, you want every item to be in your slot to be yellow by the time you get to level 20 um, some of them can be orange as well um, it, it doesn't matter but you want them to be at least be yellow every single item okay so you go in the hell tide um, you do the group events you go to the, the um, ritual stones and if you can try and put at least one heart on one of those three ritual stones and everybody else in the group puts puts a heart on you'll get better gear because this game encourages teamwork so if you put a heart on you'll get better gear if you don't put a heart on you you'll get gear but it won't be as good as if you'd have put a heart on so you get to level 20, you do whatever you need to do, and then you move up to world tier 2. And then you come back to these guys. So you want the occultist and you want the blacksmith. Because it's all about um, getting the um, aspects and doing the tempering. Um, so you can move up these um, uh, to level 100 as quickly as possible. So if you look on my gear, like I'm maxed out. So I'll just swap anything out for now, um, just to show you. So I'll do the boots. Okay, so then I'll come to this guy, and then I'll put the boots on. So for the boots, for me, I need um, Ghost Walker. Okay, so I put the boots on. You got the codex closes down. It's always under mobility. If you look there, it's Ghost Walker. Now I'm not going to do it because look, it's that it's, it's just cost it's cost it's going to cost me 332 grand plus all the materials and things like that. When you're low level, it doesn't cost you anywhere near that. Honestly, when you're level 20, it costs you something like 7,000 gold. You know what I mean? And, and not even half of those materials. So that's why it's 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 a really good way of doing it of of getting leveled up as quickly as possible. You'd be strong as possible as early as possible. So you roll that, you do what you need to do, and then you come over to this guy. And I'll, I'll use a, a different item because it, it won't let me do it with such a low level. And then you go to the tempering, which is the third one over. So I know it's the boots that I changed, but for for the sake of it, um, I'll just pick one that I haven't done. There you go. So we do chest. So for the chest, I need maximum life or lucky hit chance with stun. So if you go to there, look, see, like it says maximum life. And with the tempering, you, you can do it now. I mean, it makes no difference. Like I will do it because it's only materials because um, I've stacked up quite a lot of materials over my time of all the farming that I've done and it doesn't cost any gold so but the bad thing is 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 it four tries I think it is I think you've got four or five tries you get so if you don't get what you need in those four or five tries um, you you can't re-roll after that you have to wait for your next item so, well, I mean total armor's not, not it's not terrible you know what I mean I'm not using the item anyway but you, you get the idea and then you just keep re-rolling it so I can, I will, I will re-roll it one more time to see if we can get maximum life. Um, or total armor again. But that's that's the look of the draw. Like I said, I've had some items where I've run out of rolls and I've had to wait for the next one to come along. But that's how you do it. 
So you, you need to be back here every single item that's upgraded. Now I did it even if the upgrade is only 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 10, 100. Doesn't really matter because it's so cheap to do it early level. So you just keep coming back here and just keep re-rolling and re-rolling and re-rolling. Now that allowed me to move from world tier 2 to world tier 3 at level 20. That's how strong my build was. And then I moved from world tier 3 to world tier 4 at 50. At level 50. Now I could, probably could have done it a lot earlier than that i probably could have done it around 35 or 40 i just did it to be on the safe side and then the whole time then from level from world tier 3 you start hitting the nightmare dungeons um you can't do the paragons um at level 30 you have to wait to level 50 for that but it's still good xp it's still good loot um i was doing um level enemy level 70 76 at level 30 and level 20 um, so that's how good this build was. I was just flying through the Nightmare Dungeons. Now, early level, you fly through them. When you get to around 50, 55, 60, from 50 onwards, that's when you start hitting an, a, a, the next tier of, of enemies. Because you'll be World Tier 4, they're stronger, your gear will, will not be as strong as, as it has been coming up to level 50. And you're only in your first Paragon board. Now, with any build, I think my own personal opinion is, is that once you hit the second Paragon board, that's when you, your build start, really does start to take effect. So the first five, maybe ten levels, you might think, oh, no, this, this isn't working. But trust me, it is work. It will work. I'm level 72, and I'm flying through these Nightmare Dungeons. Absolutely annihilating the enemies, annihilating the bosses. And I've, I, I'm... Can't do them quick enough. I mean, I started I, I started filming about three hours ago, and I'm level uh, 72, and that's with all the all the messing about that I've had to do. So I'll I'll be level 100 in the next like hour, maybe hour and a half, something like that, two hours, and I'll be done. So yeah, so that's it. So that's the steps. Just uh, remember the steps. So get to level 20, and move up to world tier two. Start uh, rolling your aspects and and your um, tempering. Um, get the, do the uh, dungeon that gets you up to world tier 3 get up to world tier 3 get straight into the nightmare dungeons do the nightmare dungeons until you're happy that you, you, you you're strong enough to move up to world tier 4 so like i said i did it at 50 you could probably do it around 40 get up to world tier 4 get to level 50 if you're not already there start doing the paragon board and just fly through those nightmare dungeons and you'll be level level 100 before you know it enjoy <laughs>